Welcome back, this is Jack, and today we got Desolation Suicidal Gunslinger. I think I went backwards on that one. <laughs> so I have, uh... I have this friend in a, uh... In a Discord server that I'm, uh... That I'm a part of. It's the Rain Meter Discord server. I've, uh, spoken about them in the past. And, uh... I'm, uh, I've got, uh, I've got somebody who I would consider to be... A, uh, a reasonably close friend. Anyway, for for what for what you can do online, you know, um, but I don't get to talk to them all that much. They're they're like they're they're one of the they're one of the people I most enjoy talking to personally. I like uh, you know, it's typically in the conversations that are interesting to me. I I particularly enjoy conversations that are interesting to me. Um, so you know, I I, uh, I enjoy talking to them and. Uh, it's 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 a good it's a good thing all around. He enjoys talking to me, and we're both like, yeah, let's talk, dude. And uh, it's, it's like it's a good thing for for everybody involved, except for the people who have to listen to us talk. And they're like, I don't understand, and I don't care. Uh, but you know, that's not my problem. Uh, anyway, we uh, we don't talk much these days, though, and it's it's weird because we could, you know. And I I want I want to explain what I mean by that. So right now, currently, he's. He's active in the Discord. I, ca I can see him <laughs> chatting in the Discord right now, but I'm like, but I'm recording. Um, last night, I'm uh, I'm uh, like working on thumbnails and stuff before I go to bed, and like Something right when I start it. working on it, like I was talking right up until the moment he came by, and then I was like, well, like I have to go and do thumbnails, and then he stops by, and I'm like, well, I kind of would like to stop by and talk, but like. I have responsibilities and stuff, um, so it's kind of like when we talk, I don't know, I, I kind of get this feeling of like, haven't seen you in a while, you know, like when, when, when you're speaking to a friend that you haven't really talked to in like, you know, a month or two or whatever, I kind of, I kind of get that feeling, but, but it's like, it's like a weird way, because I do like, you know, see him talking to other people and he sees me talking to other people, like all the time, we just, we don't communicate with each other, which is, uh, you know fine it's not the end of the world you know we still we still talk on occasion and it's 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 a it's a fine time but it's a, it always gives me that that weird feeling of you know haven't seen somebody in a while and you get to you get to talk to him again and it's a, it's a pleasant feeling in my opinion anyway but it's it's weird to, to come from this because like I can see him talking right now and I'm like I could just like not record and and go chat but then I'm like but you know, typically when we chat it, it, it goes on for like a few hours and I don't, I don't have the time, so I don't uh, I don't have the ability to do that. <laughs> like the time's just not there. And then uh, when I'm like free later, you know, he's probably sleeping or whatever. And uh, well, that's fair. Or uh, he's not sleeping, but he's working on something else. And it's just like the uh, the schedules just kind of line up perfectly. On the uh, on the weekdays somehow, and it's I just I find it funny because it'll it'll be it'll be like a month or two, like we talked on uh, on Sunday. It's probably gonna be like a month or two before we talk again in, in like earnest, and uh, you know meanwhile both of us are, are like being involved in conversations that the other person is involved in, but just like <laughs> can't it doesn't line up, and uh, I just I think that's funny. I think that's funny. I'm not really concerned about it because like. You know, it's it's nice to talk to him, but at the same time, I uh, it's nice to do other things too. So, you know, I I I, I see that he's not dead. <laughs> that's 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 what that's what really matters to me is that uh, he ain't dead yet. So, anyway, I just thought it was funny as I see him chatting here, and I'm like, yeah, I'm probably not gonna get to chat to you. Like, I'm not gonna get to talk to him in like in earnest. You know, there might be some some moments in passing, like, hey, how's it going? Oh, it's going pretty good. Yeah. Well, see ya, you know, but um, no, no, no earnest conversations about uh, about anything for probably another month or two. Just with the way that things line up, it's it just kind of works out that way typically. Um, but it's uh, I think it's funny. I think it's funny. Sad, maybe, but but funny as well. Um, anyway, you guys, uh, you guys have friends that you only talk to like every so often. Oh, like I have a. Uh, I have I have friends from my my old D and D group from way back, way way back, 
not way way back, but like we we broke up in uh, oh, to see February of voice. this year. Oh, Haven't spoken to them. Yeah, we can let, let's even let's even take a peek here. When's the last time I sent even a message in there? It would have been July twenty fourth. I talked about another D and D group I had, and then somebody said, "Damn, that's some good rolling," and uh, that was it. Before that was July fifteenth, and then July eleventh, and then June nineteenth. And then June 17th, when one of them, you know, had a child. And, uh, you know, before that, it was May 7th. And then the last time we played would have been, like, forever ago, back in, like, February or something. And, uh... Oh, God, I did it wrong. No, get me back to the... Eee! Oh, my God, I hate... My mouse is over here. Right, but I have to like go right to the edge of the screen before I can. Anyway, so that's uh, you know, I don't talk to those guys very often, but I consider them to be some of my, uh, well, the the friends that I have the most fun with. I wouldn't, I wouldn't necessarily call them the, my like my best friends because they're not. <laughs> Sorry if you guys are watching. You're not my best friends, and I'm not your best friend. That's okay, but uh, they are the friends that I have the most fun with when I'm with, um, because we play D and D, and that's the most fun thing that you can do, um, but. We don't, we don't really talk at all anymore, which is, is sad because like it, it really shows that the D and D was like the only thing that was really holding us together as a, as a group. That uh, outside of that, we really don't have too much kind of keeping us in one piece. And I think that uh, I know that they all have kids, every one of them except for me. So they they, they might be communicating just without me, p p potentially. I know that. Um, at least two of them were, because they their, their kids ended up being friends as well as results, and that kind of ends up kind of pushing. I'm not jealous of them talking together. Like if they have they have kids and I don't, and that's okay. Um, but uh, yeah, I don't know. It's um, oh god, I want to win though, dude. Um, yeah. Anyway, uh. It was really the D&D that was holding us together as a group, which is fine. You know, I'm not like, wow, I hate these guys. They they don't play D&D &D with me. They all suck. No, like, they're they're cool guys. I like them, but, uh, you know, without the D&D, &D, there they're just isn't really motivating us to, to kind of be together anymore. I've tried a couple of times to to kind of, like, just chat and stuff, and it just it doesn't work, and I'm uh, that's okay. You know, it, it, it's okay. Um, it's perfectly fine for that to not work. And, uh, I think that that's even, like, more more than just a bad thing. I think that's, you know, for, for I don't know that some people might think of it, like, as a, as a negative. You know, like, the only thing that's keeping you together was D&D. &D, then maybe you guys should, like, find people that you like more to play D&D &D with, and you might have more fun. But I think that's not necessarily true. I think that it's cool how people who wouldn't normally be together, who wouldn't normally, you know, hang out and stuff, can, can be brought together and and have so much fun together. Just because of uh, Dungeons and Dragons, I think that's what's really, really cool about Dungeons and Dragons, personally, because like we're we're so different, you know, like just just like from such different parts of of the world, and and like so different like walks of life, but uh, like the D and D when we were playing it anyway, kind of brought us all together, and I think that was really cool. Um. I do want to get back together with them and start playing again, but like, I wasn't the DM, <laughs> and I'm not gonna be the DM, so it's always kind of uh, a hard question to ask when you're not the DM. Like, hey, you guys want to get back together again? Yeah, you willing to take up that responsibility again so it's a DM for us? Like, you know, they have fun, but like, it is a big responsibility, and you're asking them to take a lot. And then when they say no, you know. When they say no, they're gonna feel like a jerk because you know they can't. Everybody else is like, "Yeah, that sounds sick," and they're like, "I can't really DM." So, and then you know they feel like they let everybody down, and I'm like, "You didn't really let anybody down. It's just it's a big responsibility. I get it." But, um, definitely, uh, you know, just I don't really talk to them ever, which is is sad. It's sad. We like it was, it, and it's bizarre because when we were playing D and D. Not only were we playing D&D, &D, but we were also like playing video games together at times. Like we got together 
for things that weren't necessarily just D and D. We chatted in the Discord on the regular, and then the D and D disappeared, and all of a sudden we're not doing any of that. It really was the D and D that was that was holding us all together, and I think that's really really cool personally. You know, it's it's sad that we don't get to to, to chill and, and talk anymore because I like talking with them a lot, but at the same time it's kind of it, it's really fascinating how how just uh, a single you know tabletop role playing game can can have that much of an influence. I think that's really really cool. Um, personally, anyway, you know. No, I don't want you to explode. I think it's cool. And it is it is sad. And I cried when we when we stopped. I did. I, w I won't deny it. But I cry easily, so it's not saying much. <laughs> uh, but I cried when we uh, when we stopped playing for sure, because I'm, I'm gonna miss them and. Uh, I, 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 I did miss them and I do miss them but at the same time you know it's just Justin in my seat here just gotta get comfy um, at the same time it's you know we all have our own lives to live and that's fine you know what I met a kid he had to, to move and stuff and get a house that was good I've, I've talked about it before you know they, they all had valid reasons for for having to go their own way you know no, nobody was really sitting there like I just don't like you guys. You know, no, nobody was, nobody was like that. You know, it was all kind of like, uh, yeah, I guess we're just kind of not gonna be able to make it work, huh? And then it was, you know, yep, just not gonna work. And that's sad. Are you up over here? Where are you? I hate, I hate this. Boy, howdy, do I hate this. Great. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how well the sound gets picked up, but like, I'm freaked, yo. <laughs> that was like weird little poops running around all over the place, all around me, and I'm like, where the heck? Probably coming up over here. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. Yeah, I, want, I want this to end all these poops because he's had plenty of time to make poops. So, uh, we want to make sure we get rid of him. <laughs> okay, but uh, we, we found him. I was spooked, yo. I was spooked. That was a spooky boss fight. Um, but we're done now. Well, we're done with the spookiness anyway. We're not necessarily done with the boss fight. He's not dead yet. But... Yeah, most most of the time when when you know, the I don't know if he's you know not dead yet is a is a saying or not. I don't know if it's like a, a quote from something, but I don't know that a lot of people say it. The friend that I was talking to earlier says it a lot. Uh, my mother says it a lot. I say it a lot. Maybe maybe perhaps I started saying it because of him, and then my mother started saying it because of me. But I uh, I notice it a lot anyway. I don't know if it's from anything or or whatever, but typically when I hear it. It, uh, it refers to, to somebody who you would rather not be dead, you know, like, not dead yet, so, uh, you know, don't complain too much, kind of thing, um, or whatever. In this case, he's not dead yet, so, uh, we got a problem to fix. I'm feeling generous. I'm feeling generous. Yeah, to who? To the dead corpse you just murdered? Sure. I will say, close fight. <laughs> Reasonably close, but I wasn't worried for a moment. Um, <laughs> sometimes it happens like that. You end up, you end the fight on one HP. That's okay. That's okay. Oh god! I have a webcam. I never use it. I'm getting more used to taking these dang sulfur pills. They taste bad still, but like I'm just I'm used to them. You are here to clean out and I hate it, <laughs> cause like the other ones they had they had mint in it I guess. Uh, they also tasted pretty bad, like pretty ma pretty bad. Um, and uh, they uh, they kind of sucked as well, you know, like they 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 sucked and. But, but at the very least, they weren't, like, too bad. They weren't 
too bad. Um, I mean, you know, when I was taking them, I thought they were the worst thing I ever had to, to take in my life. Nowadays, I realize, no, beautiful thing. Give me that. <laughs> but, uh, like, it sucks because, like, I'm used to it, but it's still just horribly disgusting. So, like, I guess, um, you know, I'm, I'm used to the, the terrible flavor. I'm not going to throw up. It's still just as unpleasant as it's ever been, though. So it's not like I'm like, I don't know. It still sucks, is what I'm saying, but I'm not going to throw up anymore. There's no, you know, gag reflex to it anymore. It's, uh, that's handled, but uh, I still, I still don't, you know. It's not, it's not an acquired taste, okay? It's an acquired keep it not being wretched out of your very essence the moment you put it in your mouth. Um, but I'm getting I'm getting more used to taking them now. I'm getting more used to taking them. What I have to work on, and I think I can do because my voice, like I have a lot of range in the uh, the sound, like the sound level of my voice as I talk. Because I kind of go from like up here to like I sometimes talk down here even. And uh, there's there's like a lot of range in my voice, and I think I want to get like an equalizer maybe. Is that what does it? I don't know. But I want to get some some stuff in my voice to make the 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 sound level the like. Like, loudness of it fairly more consistent uh, across the board so that it's a little bit easier for me to balance my audio and stuff out because uh, that's a bit of a pain at times um, when I'm like listening to stuff back I'm like oh you're really quiet here and then you're like oh you're really loud here so I can't just like make stuff like different and stuff like it's I have to I have to work on on equalizing it like across the board and I don't know if that's an equalizer because I don't know anything about audio so if you guys know anything about audio Hit me up, dude. Hit me up. I need help. I don't know what I'm doing when it comes to audio. I know that OBS has, like, uh, options and stuff, and the, it's got filters and stuff that I can toss in. I might might play with that a little bit. You know what? Let's play with it right now. Let's play with it live on camera. Okay, so we go to the mic. We go uh, filters. You add in a filter. Okay. Mm, compressor. What does what the compressor do? Is this doing something yet? <laughs> I don't know. Has it changed? What has it changed? I don't know. We're going to get rid of it because this might sound really, really terrible. I don't know. What about... Uh, okay, the compressor is gone now. Okay. Uh, we'll, get, we'll get an expander. It's the opposite of a compressor. Check that out, dude. Now I sound expanded. Uh, we're going to get rid of that, though. Uh, we have an invert polarity, a limiter... A noise gate, noise suppression. Put both of those on and then, uh, you know, make it. <laughs> you gotta aim for that sweet spot. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't really have like a balancer. <laughs> There's no balance option. I have no idea what my voice sounded like throughout that, by the way. I don't have any, uh, any feedback on my voice. So I don't get to hear it. I used to. I used to. Ah, oh, man, my. I have like a, see a dude, I have uh, this, this weird pain in my like lower jaw, which makes sense because I'm talking a lot <laughs> recently, um, now that's bullet time. but I don't think it's anything worth being concerned over. I'm like, I'm trying, I'm trying to like feel around my jaw. I don't feel anything, uh, yeah, I don't feel anything that I want to be concerned about. Just, just some mild pain. Which is uh, is likely due to me talking differently so that I don't aggravate the roof of my mouth. Um, because it's burnt, dude! It hurts! Um, yeah, whatever. It's a muscle, right? The, 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 the jaw? The thing that moves the jaw? It's a muscle. And uh, with all the talking I'm doing, I'm gonna... I tell you what. My jaw muscle... <laughs> Ooh it's gonna be quite the... The impressive, uh, it's going to be quite the impressive little thing, and, uh, yes, please, forgot to upgrade that, that would have been terrible, eh? Um, it's going to be, it's going to be quite the impressive little muscle there, you know, it's like when you look at people who have, like, you know, freakishly large arms, and then, like, tiny legs and tiny, you know, everything else. Nah, dude, it's, I'm going to be like, oh, what's, what's the name of, uh, Cliff? From, from Fair, I'm trying to think of the, the name of the... The superhero in Fairly Odd Parents, who uh, Timmy's a fan of. It's like Cliff or something like that. 
He's got like the gigantic chin. That's what I'm gonna be like in like 10 years. <laughs> as, as the muscle of my, my voice and uh, jaw as I'm... Because I do a lot of uh, very uh, emotive talking. Like I tell you, when I get a webcam one day, you guys are gonna be like, holy crap, you move a lot as you're commentating. I'm like, yeah, I told you. If you didn't believe me, but like, you think I can even stay inside the frame of a webcam? Like, I tell you not, dude. It ain't happening. Um. Nope. Because it, it just ain't happening, dude. Um. But, uh. Yeah, it's, uh. I, th I think I'm, like, kind of, like, subconsciously. I mean, that, that's what happens with injuries, right? That's why it's important to rest your injuries. Like, when you are when you have, like, a leg injury or something like that. Like, what you're going to do is you're going to subconsciously kind of, like, avoid aggravating it. And then you're going to injure your other leg as you, as you, like, limp around a little bit, you know? Even if you don't think you're limping, you are. You know? Probably. Anyway. There's, there's, a, there's a good chance that you are. No. There's a pretty good chance that you are limping, and uh, there's a pretty good chance that uh, it's, it's messing up your other leg, and then, you know, down that leg's in a little bit of pain, and you, you, just, you just rest, right? Uh, however, I don't, I don't get that option. Um, <laughs> I, don't, I don't have that option. I have to record. I have so much responsibilities. Um, I'm, not, I'm not actually in that much pain. I'll, I'll, I'll you know, keep an eye on it. If, it's, uh, if it gets, you know, significantly worse, then... Uh, I'll, uh, I'll chill out. Like, I've, like I was saying in, in, uh, in yesterday's episode, I think, or the last episode I recorded, anyway. Um, I just... I have a lot of recording already done, so, like, I could just not record for... I mean, at this point in time, I could not record anything else today. And then... No, I would have to record at least... No, I don't have to record anything else to have today. Like after this, I don't like. I'm done. Today, uh, tomorrow, I have to get at least one KFT recorded. That's it. You know, I'm done until Thursday at this point, basically, right? Like I am backlogged right on up, which is uh, is good. Or I would have to get a Yamcha tries done for tomorrow. But like, whatever, dude. No, I don't have to get a Yamcha tries done for tomorrow, do I? No, I don't. Yeah, it's already it's already done. So yeah, I'm I'm, I'm good up until Thursday. I just have to get uh, one more KFT recorded after this before like. You know, tomorrow night, <laughs> which is is fine. Um, and then you know the the, the third the first Thursday video is 8 a.m. So like, yeah, I'm not gonna get up at 7:30. So I guess that's or like at like 6:30 rather. So I guess that's uh, one thing. And then I don't know. There's there's like a old mess. Anyway, uh, like if if I have to take a break, I have the ability to take a break. I have uh, enough of a backlog that uh, it's fine. But I'd rather just not if I can avoid it because I, I like recording. I, I enjoy it. It's fun. And uh, I think you guys like seeing the commentary as I, as I go. I, I like to... I mean, the thing is I can't record like too much KF2. So the KF2 is never going to have like that big of a backlog. The Amberjack tries and the Gunfire Reborn. I'm not making promises. Okay, those might be backlogged by like months at a time in the future. Okay? <laughs> just, just, just because like they will. Okay? Maybe. Probably not months, but like they might be backlogged by like a week or two even, you know? They, they, they might be... You, you're never gonna know. Well, I, I might tell you, but... The, the, the backlog on those eps, those, those series is, is just, it's um... I don't have any control over that, okay? I mean, I have all of the control over that, I'm the one who makes the decision. But I, well, I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, the KF2 videos I have to record three a day and I'm not gonna record more than that even if I have the time I'm not recording more than that uh, because I think that if I record more than that the commentary begins to suffer as I just run out of things to talk about you know um, like once I get to four episodes I'm like what do I talk about in the fourth episode plus I have to like stream and stuff and it's just like dude oh what a shot what a shot you gotta admit that was a good shot you gotta admit it was a good shot Okay, okay, okay. It was a good. Sh it was. It was a good shot. Um, like that was that was that was a good. I'm happy with that. Okay. Anyway, um, yeah, I have to record three KF two a day, so I don't really get to avoid that. The KF two backlog is never 
that big because I just I don't I don't I, I feel like you know the KF2 commentary is really where where my commentary shines I feel and you know my, my commentary I'm not, I'm not quite at the level of where I want to be yet I'm not quite there yet but you know even still the, the KF2 videos are where I do some of my best work I want to keep that up I want to make sure that we're we're kind of sticking to it. I mean KF2 is the game that I'm the most comfortable in right even if it's not the game that I have the most hours in, out of all the games that I record, anyway, KF2 is the game that I, uh, I, I am just the most comfortable in, and, and like, I kind of like, eh, not gonna make it, but I kind of just have the, the most natural sort of, um, I hate, I hate, I hate having to hide around something on that side, okay? On this side, you kind of get to, like, peek a little bit. Anyway, I don't really have to talk about stuff, because I'm just like, I know it all just kind of like you now I know what's going on I'm able to kind of like pay attention to it just kind of like out of muscle memory you know so it's 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 kind of it's kind of good for that but um no other game that I uh, that I record kind of has that you know gunfire reborn's not there yet uh even if I were to be like streaming like monster hunter or something like that like I'm not I'm not at the point yet where I can uh, kind of just turn off my brain and 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 hunt some monsters and stuff and not new monsters anyway um you know, with RuneScape, I'm not at the point where I can... That's the wrong button. I'm sorry. They're very close, okay? This is the button for throwing. This is the button for... I shouldn't have hit that button. <laughs> that was not a good button to hit. Uh, and then this is the button just below that. So, anyway. Anywho, look at all them stats, dude. 40,000 damage. That's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Well, probably Prestige Survivalist. Like, we get like a couple hundred XP every single game anyway, right? Like, we'll eventually get it all the way up to, <laughs> to like max Prestige without even having to play a single match. Um, yeah, like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. How many times is she going to say goodbye before the video ends? You could look at the, the length of the video, but would that really tell